Hello everyone and welcome back to the Minecraft Let's Play of Shelly Gaming. Ooh, I can still hear those wolves in the background. Love you, wolf. I love you. Love you like a bro. Um so anyways, I am getting a little bit better at this Minecraft thing. I've had it for quite a while, and I'm starting to get kinda used to um doing this first night thing. Um I have um done hardcore before. The first one ended kind of on the first night with a creeper to the back. Um, I'm sure anybody out there who's played Minecraft can kind of relate to how I felt there. Just utter heartache. I mean, I just couldn't handle it. It felt it felt so bad. It was like breaking up with a girlfriend. Except I didn't. I wouldn't know what that's like. Sadness. So, anyways, about girls. Um. Does anybody out there have girl problems? Because I certainly do. Um, as you can imagine, teenage life isn't all it's cracked up to be. Um, excuse me, I need to make these sticks first. Um, so if anybody out there has had a girlfriend or has hit on a girl that they really liked, um, and was led to believe that, um, she liked them. Um, I know exactly how you feel because that has happened to me. Um, this one girl in our class liked me, or at least she said she did. I asked her out after school. She said yes. And as you can imagine, um, about I don't know, like an hour later, um, after I was done with my basketball practice, um, I got a message from her saying that she really didn't like me. Um, and that she was distracted. So I was kind of upset, you know. But here's the thing, you can't you can't hold any of that against girls and I learned the hard way that um girls have a lot on their minds. Um, usually more than us guys do. Um you can't really hold them accountable for anything. Um because you know, they're girls. Um we have to be nice to girls because um that's what God wants us to do. Um I shouldn't really be bringing God or anything into this, but I'm just going to tell you right off the bat that I am a pretty hardcore Christian, I guess, um, and so I might say something random about God, um, I apologize if you don't agree with my beliefs and I annoy the heck out of you, um, so I will try to keep that on my YouTube videos though, that might be a little bit hard, um, um, my friends and I wanted to make this channel after we saw other, um, channels of kids about our age. And they had quite a bit of views, and we were, like, we were pretty impressed with them. And we thought, well, maybe we can do this, too. I mean, it looks hard, but, um, we thought we could pull it off. And it seems, um, we finally just got down to doing it, and here we are. Um, we should have about, um, ten uploads at the end of this day. Which is a pretty solid start, if you ask me, um... Again, that's if you ask me, and not many people are going to ask me, so my opinion doesn't really matter. Um, yeah, I can still hear those wolves, and I'm just itching to rape a skeleton and get that wolf. I just want that wolf so bad. Mm -mm. Oh, come on, stupid lag. Why are you placing multiple churches? Son of a gun. Um... Also, if anybody happens to be watching this video and has played MW3, leave your um, comment on how MW3, how you thought of MW3 um, in the comments below. Because I, I really like it. I hear like some people really hate it and stuff. But personally, I think it's a great game. I really like it. Um, the gun balance is fantastic, except you got those guns like the Type 95 and crap. FMG9s. Um... Infinity Ward tries to balance it. Personally, I'm a, I'm a, um, not a Treyarch fanboy. I really like, um, Infinity Ward is where it's at, if you'd ask me. Stupid leg. Stop it. Go, go, go. Oh. Okay, I'm going to close the store without my leg messing up. <gasps> oh, come on. Watch this. Pure skill. <clears throat> yes. I closed that door with the ultimate leg setting. Um, if you ever... Oh, I can hear you, Zambi. He's outside. I feel like going on a little mission here. Let's get ourselves a cobblestone sword and go on a little, um, fun outside. 
Um, I can hear you, Zambi, and I'm really, I don't feel confident coming outside. Don't ambush me, don't ambush me. I'm on hardcore, so if I die, I have to delete the world, which is kind of funny. I like how, um, uh, I really like how, um, come on, Mojang, I like how they made it so you have to delete the world yourself. Um, oh, crap, skeletons. How you have to delete the world yourself? When you die in hardcore, come on, lag, quit it. How you have to delete the world yourself? In hardcore, because it makes you feel very sad about yourself. Oh my god, I have to delete my world. I feel so bad. Crap like that. Ooh, hi, wolf. I'm going to tame you no matter what the cost. Wolf, come on, come on. Get, get, get. Oh. Come on, I need to tame you, so I'm going to go kill this skelly. Oh, crap. I'm going to kill the skeleton. No, 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 don't, don't, don't make me. Oh. This is embarrassing. This is very embarrassing. My ambish, my ambitious behavior has resulted in me dying, and I've paid for it. And now these skeletons are teabagging my Bobby, my um, Bobby. No, not my Bobby, my Bobby. These skeletons are teabagging my body, and I'm very embarrassed. I'm harassed um, by these guys with noob tubes. Just kidding. They are not. They don't have noob tubes. They're skilled with a bow. So I'm actually just gonna have to. As I said, I'm gonna have to delete this world. I feel so bad about it, but um, I apologize for my crappy behavior. I'm just gonna blame it on my leggy computer. Um, thank you for watching. Um, keep watching these skeletons teabag me. Thank you, and goodbye.